Okay guys, there's a very special breakout that is ongoing and we are looking at Ethereum's dominance breaking out of the 20% regions guys. This means that most likely in the coming days, 5% of the crypto market would simply get liquidated into Ethereum guys. This is something which is happening right now and this is a possible event. I'm not saying that this is just going to happen right at the bat, but we have kind of initiated a good looking breakout move coming from 20 regions that could simply put the Ethereum's market dominance at your 25% zones guys. Well, let's see what happens, but if we combine the price action with ETH, BTC right here, I don't know guys, this one has been there for a very long time. I do believe we were trading somewhere here when I charted out this one for the first time ever, I guess. But we are looking at a clear cut. Guys, we are at the resistance right here. This is again, this is just looking to me like the dominance chart itself. So if Ethereum BTC is able to break out above the 8 million Satoshi regions, that would most likely save most of the altcoins in the market, right? Because guys, you know the deal. Ethereum is a trend decider for most of the altcoins. If Ethereum goes bullish in the market, it might take some time, but the liquidity kind of flows into altcoins if Ethereum generally stays bullish in the market. As you can see, the ETH BTC ratio is kind of wanting to flip out, guys although we are just at the resistance guys so well if we just talk about the technical patterns right here this is going to be a rejection in the first and the foremost pass and i would be expecting let's just say a little consolidation in the small time frames but this one is kind of rushing towards the breakout guys and why do i say this right here because we are breaking out of a dominance region as well guys this is a huge huge region the region that was under formulation ever since the second week of May itself. Now we have finally resolved this squeeze to the upside. And if you combine this with ETH BTC pair, so that means that this breakout, which is about to happen, could potentially could potentially lead into crazy stuff in the market, guys. Well, if you talk about the USD pair itself, most likely we have initiated our move towards the 5,500 regions on Ethereum as well, guys. This is something which you're talking about again and again, right? Now, on the immediate small time frames, I was taking a look at this entire piece of rejection as a maybe as a continuation momentum with the downside, but it looks to me like that the bears were not strengthened in the market. The selling that came from these levels was not enough, right? So, which is why bulls took the charge right here and as soon as we get got inside this channel guys the usd pair has also started looking bullish in the market and if we talk about the bigger time frames right here like the four hour or the 12 hour time frame we are kind of resolving a squeeze to the upside as well guys so what you can see right here is that ethereum in the dominance chart in the btc chart and in the usd chart has started looking really bullish in the market guys so whatever happens in ethereum for the rest of the year itself is going to be really exciting for altcoin market as a whole guys with that said that was a quick little update on ethereum i hope you found out any value if you found any value from this video hit that like bell subscribe all the good things i'll be talking about bitcoin long-term trends in the next video pretty soon guys bye for now